Christmas tree. This is a film made in Russia, 1959. Original music composed and conducted by Nikolsky. Produced by Martin Gilbert. Once upon a Christmas in Moscow, Russia, there lived a little boy named Kolya. He always loved the Christmas season. It was the time of year when people were happy and trees were decorated with many beautiful ornaments. This year was different for Kolya. As he looked at all the pretty decorations on the Christmas tree, he thought of his father who worked as a weatherman in faraway Antarctica. Kolya knew that in the land at the bottom of the world, there were no trees to decorate, nothing but ice and snow. If only there was some way Daddy could have a Christmas tree. Why, Christmas just isn't Christmas without a tree and all the ornaments. Yes, if only there was a way Kolya could be sure his daddy would have a tree for Christmas. Hmm, if only there was a way, if only. I don't have enough gas. Say, look, there's someone who can help. That's Santa Claus. Kolya looked up into the clear night sky and saw Santa Claus zooming about in his star-studded jet plane. It streaked across the sky, brighter than any comet. Then it swooped to the ground and slid to a stop. Santa, Santa Claus, hello, hello. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Kolya. Now, what would you like this year? A mechanical toy, or how about a big television set? Hmm? Oh, Santa, my daddy. I know you'd like to take him that Christmas tree. Well, you take my plane. But you must reach your daddy in Antarctica before the clock strikes 12. Or else. Now, when the clock strikes the first chime, climb aboard the star shooter and take off. Stop for nothing. That's a mighty long trip. It could be hard to do. Just keep going, for with the last chime at 12, the Christmas magic will stop. Oh, I understand, Santa, but what do I... Now, have... now, Kolya, just hang on to your tree. Don't hit the Big Dipper. Keep going south. Mm -hmm. And remember, you must be there before the 12th chime. Oh, I see. Uh-huh. Goodbye, now. <gasps> Is that the first chime? Yes, there's no time to lose. All right, I'll do as you say. Thank you, Santa. Bye. I'm off to Antarctica. <laughs> Let's go, driver. I've got more work to do. Off, Kolya went into space with the magic of Santa's starship. He clutched his decorated tree, his heart pounding with anxiety, very determined to reach Antarctica before the last jump. Second chime, and Kolya was approaching Italy. I can hardly believe it. It's beautiful. The sky lit up with magnificent fireworks in celebration of the Yuletide season. There was so much to see. And then, Kolya grew very warm. Phew, we must be going over Africa. Ooh, it's a long way down. And as Kolya looked below, a horrifying sight caught his eyes. A sandstorm swirled angrily from the ground. The fierce wind whipped round and round. Higher and higher went the wind. And as the third chime sounded, the violent wind surrounded the star-studded ship and crumbled it like stardust. Kolya clung to his Christmas tree with all his might. Chime, what can I do? I've got to get there. I, I must. Oh. 
I say. Oh, please don't eat me, Mr. Lion. I don't taste good. <laughs> I wouldn't eat a little boy. I have children of my own. I just want to know where you got your pretty Christmas tree. Oh, from my home in Russia. That's where. I've been running all over Africa looking for one. What a waste of time. Oh, I'd give you this one. But I can't because I want to take it to my daddy in Antarctica. It's for Christmas. <gasps> it's a big time. Oh, no. Oh, quick. Which way is the South Pole? Mm, let me see. Bless my stars, I do remember. It's that way. Go straight and turn right. Uh oh, thanks. But I don't think I can go fast enough. You go fast. I'm in such a hurry. Could you? Give you a ride? Why, sure, Sonny. Hold on tight. It's a six. Please hurry. Whoops! I don't do well in water. Boys, stop monkeying around and build a raft for this lad. He's got to reach Antarctica immediately. <laughs> That's service, lad. The raft on a float through to Antarctica. Wonderful. <laughs> Thanks, everyone. Still clutching his tree as the seventh chime sounded, Kolya stood bravely on his raft. When a huge wave swelled, his raft fell apart. Then his feet touched something strange. No, how in the salty seas did such a little boy get way out here? Oh, I'm on my way to Antarctica. Can you hear? Could you help me get to Antarctica, Mr. Whale? Oh! Did he eat? I've got to hurry, please. No, 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 no blubbering. Leave that to the whales, and I'll give you a whale of a ride. The whale proudly shot through the rough waters, faster than any ship could sail to the very shores of Antarctica. Thanks! Once ashore, Collier trudged onward, even though a snowstorm almost broke his last hopes. My dad's not afraid of snowstorms, so I won't be either. Frozen icebergs. What kind of a bird a bird are you? Oh, I'm no bird. I'm a boy. And I'm looking for my father. A boy? Oh, my goodness. I'm a penguin, so you're a human boy. That's very interesting. <gasps> the tenth time. Oh, please. Where's the weather station? The what? The what? The what? The weather station? Oh, I'm glad you're a boy. I'm a penguin. Are you sure? Oh, you're the son of the weatherman at the camp. I thought you were. Yes, you look like him. Just like him. I look like my family, too. See? Don't we all look alike? We always have looked alike. Never saw anything before like it. We always look alike. Yes, we do. Oh, please. Please, my daddy. You don't understand. I do. I do. I do. Want me to sing for you? <gasps> Let's see you have a We'll have to hurry or I'll be late. <laughs> We'll help you then. Come on, everybody. Uh. Hey, you want something? Oh, we're too late. Oh, oh there it is. Too late. Too late. Collier was frozen with disappointment. He couldn't go any further. Here's a cable for you from Antarctica. Oh, Antarctica? Oh, thank you, thank you. It's from Daddy. Mother, Mother, a cable from Daddy. Oh, Mother, look, read it. Received a big Christmas tree by plane today. Merry Christmas, love, Daddy. Oh, Daddy did get his Christmas tree. He did. Hooray! That's fine. Merry Christmas. And a Happy New Year, too.